recently I got this comment on one of my posts about how you can use the source extensions to change that entry point. And this could be an interesting way to swap between Storybook and your app. So I just wanted to show how this works and maybe you can try it out if it works for you. So the way this works is in Metro, there's a option called source extensions. And what you can do is basically say, um, to specify any sort of file extension here that you want to resolve before other ones or that you want to resolve in general. The order matters. So if I put storybook TSX first, then any file with storybook.tsx gets resolved over the other one. So for in this case, what we do is we add an app.storybook.tsx. And in here, we import the storybook files. And in app.tsx, we import our application or just export our app code here. And then when we're in our Metro config, I'm saying whenever you know, Storybook is enabled using an environment variable, make sure that we load the Storybook file instead of the app file. And then what that does is when I'm running my regular command, it, it'll bring up my app. And then when I run the storybook command, it will bring up storybook. So now if I reload here, it's going to show the app still. And then if I stop and run storybook, it's going to run, um, it's going to load the storybook app. So, and the reason for that is because in the package JSON, I set the environment variable right here to be true. And that's what I'm looking at in the Metro config. So that's another way that you can swap between uh, your different entry points. And hopefully that helps you out.